Street Market is this new place that they opened a few days ago. Uh, they were supposed to open before lockdown, but you see they have to close. I'm here for some chicken wings and eat like I usually do. So. I'm about to go to um, King's Cross and see my friend for his birthday so it's today is like 33 degrees so I have SPF 100 sunscreen and SPF 50 I'm gonna layer on because I hate just like being in the sun really I don't like <laughs> just don't want skin cancer and like sun ages your skin the most so always wear sunscreen always I'm just gonna put it all over I'm so hungry, like always, <laughs> always hungry, but um, yeah, we're gonna have burgers, which I'm really excited about. So yeah, let's go. I'm just waiting for my friend and I was on the bus and today's like the hottest day, it's going to reach like 33. And there was someone wearing a coat and I was just like, I couldn't, I couldn't understand it at all. Like, it's just so weather inappropriate. It made me hot looking at the person. So yeah, crazy, crazy people. Anyway, I'm, I'm hungry. I'm waiting for the restaurant to open. It's young. At the gym. No, yeah, it's like a bike. You have the lowest fat mass in there, so it's the what last day. What did you day. eat? Right, I'm I just had to come over and see. Mmm, it is chocolate mayo. Another um, diet tip. I'm taking off the top bun because I just don't need this much bread. So, just having the burger open top. In the summer, I love orangey lipsticks. <clears throat> this is MAC Lady Danger. Just wait for that to be 
why you ask me to upload it. Jaffa cakes, which I've never seen before, so I always have to try something that I've never tried. This looks like a normal Jaffa cake. It smells like normal. Okay, I'm gonna give it a go. It's like confusing because I, it kind of tastes, turns into like normal Jaffa cake flavor, but then it's like you can taste what they're trying to do with the pineapple but it's just confusing it's not bad but it's okay it was 50p so <laughs> um, I don't know good morning um, I just woke up it's it's um, like 7 a.m. And I woke up because I've, basically the UK government have sent out to around 100,000 people random um, at-home coronavirus testing kits. And like they asked like 100,000 people if they want to take part and I got the letter and I said obviously yeah I would like to take part. I want to know if I've ever had it. Um, I don't think I've, ha I've ever had it. I've been pretty healthy all this time. I had like one day where I had like where I felt my throat was kind of um, sore, but it was literally for one day. So and then the next day I was fine. So who knows? Like, but I mean, and loads of people are asymptomatic, right? So I could have had it. I just never knew. So I got this test, and basically, I do the test at home. Then somebody comes to my house and picks up the box from between 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. So I basically have to stay at home. I don't know exactly when they're gonna come. And they said, make sure you do the test before 8 a.m. because they can come and pick it up at 8 a.m. You never know. So I woke up at seven to do this. So yeah, I'm quite nervous because I wanna do it right. I watched the video and there's loads of instructions. Comes with this and like a bag that I have to put it into. So I'll, I'll, I'm going to do my best to try and do it <laughs> correctly. Okay, so with this stick that I'm going to open soon, I have to take it and put it at the back of my throat and like um, get my tonsils and just swab it about five times, it says, and then take it out and then with the same, same end of the same stick, I have to shove it up both my nose, uh, nostrils. Oh, I'm quite scared. I mean, I've I've read the instructions like um thousands, a thousand times, but I just really want to make sure I'm gonna do it right. I'm gonna use my mirror. <sighs> Why am I nervous? Okay. 
I mean, I, I basically got, got the area. Okay, here we go. I wanted to sneeze, but... Oh, here, the other one. It just makes you want to sneeze. Okay. Okay, that was finished. Now I put this in here. And they said break off the top bit. Okay. Broken off the top bit. And now I'm putting this in here. It's in there. And I'm gonna put this in this box. All done. And then they actually said I need to put my this sample in the fridge until they need they come and collect it. I guess they need to keep it cool, so I'm gonna do that now. That's it, that's the test. And then I don't know when I'll get the results. Obviously they are gonna send me them, but let's see if, if I've ever had it. Obviously I'll report back with the results when I get them. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.